Hello everybody, this is Go Green PM again. I just got down to the campsite and uh, yeah, I'm going to show you what we've done over the last little while. I haven't done a full overview of the campsite, but uh, it's our porta potty. And now there is a fifth wheel right there. My buddy Chad's uh, it's family of uh, the owners. Great guy, great family. Uh, now my brother's trailer is facing the same way as mine. You actually can't see mine now. But uh, Phil is still in the same spot as it was. And now we have our 50 foot beer tent up. It is amazing in the middle of summer when it's blazing hot and you have nowhere to go. So that really does uh, make quite the difference. We are uh, in the midst of redoing a lot of patches on it. We uh, used a product Super 7 last week and uh, trying to replace, like, because there's rips and, like, right up there you can see rips. And some of the patches, there's a big rip that goes right up that seam we put on, and there's the patch. So this Super 7 stuff didn't work so well. I think we were going to have to use like a rubber cement. There, are, uh, These few patches are somewhat holding, but they're hanging off too, which is no good. So now we're going to have to either drop it down or try to fix them up there, which is going to be very difficult. But it's in pretty decent condition. I mean, it's dirty, but it offers a lot of shade. And we set up a picnic area in here. There's three picnic tables, and then we have a whole countertop and stuff that all comes out over here so that we can cook and serve food on. I am uh, down here working on putting my, uh, or filling my water storage container. Now you can see. So my brother, those are uh, only 15 watt panels each. This weekend, uh, the guy who owns this trailer is from Mississauga and he is coming down with solar panel kits for each one of the trailers. They're $256 I talked the guy down to per kit. That's 100 watt solar panel and uh, LCD charge controller and all the cables. So I thought that was a relatively good idea and it was a, th a 30 amp charge controller too which is which is enough that I can add three more solar panels or two more solar panels on top of the one I already have. So that's those two trailers and then back over to mine. This is my awning. I forgot to take it down when I left last time so it went through a couple of storms so it's a little saggy but it's just a gigantic tarp and I buried this actually looks like it's growing here but I actually plant or put this in the ground and then I'm just tied off onto that but see there's a huge sag in it. This all needs to be tightened up and I need to take one small tree in the middle that's in the way of tightening it nice and tight and I'm still in the midst of deciding on where to put my solar panel stand. I'm trying to figure out, I'm here, it's 2.30 in the afternoon and I'm trying to figure out where to put my solar panel stand. So there's my cement. I got to dig a hole to bury that bucket, which is extremely heavy. It goes all the way up there. It's all painted now. And that's where my solar panel is going to go. And it's all adjustable throughout the day. Let's see if I can get a view of this. I can. This pin goes on each one of these little parts that I've grinded out. So, as it's as the sun moves during the day, oh, yeah, I can't do it with one hand. There we go. There, now it's turned. There, and in the morning, there, and it locks in. I'll show you how it locks in. Each time I turn it, it goes. Whoop, then it drops right into that that next slot. So now it's aiming out front. So I'm undecided. I'm thinking maybe right there or out in front over here as of right now it looks like the smartest place would be to put it out over here beside these this post that I buried in the ground because it's got sun now where out here 
I'm thinking somewhere right in here, but it still has sun, which isn't too bad. But uh, there you go, that's, uh, that's an update on uh, everything that's down here. And uh, I'm going to do some more videos on uh, the plumbing and stuff that I'm about to do now. Thank you. This is Go Green PM signing off.